shop. Really curious to see what we have today. Let's check it out. Okay, we have the crystal skin back, which is awesome. We got Bronto. We have Bright Cutter and Bright Bomber. Great skins. I like Bright Cutter a lot. Oh, oh my goodness. This is a rare skin. Rare. Oh my. Okay. If I remember correctly, this one is not as rare as this one is currently. Uh, she came back, I think, a while ago. But this is rare, and I'm pretty sure the glider is too. Wow. We have some rare stuff today. Dynamic shuffle. Cool. This hasn't been back in a while. Oh, what else? Second, I shall and sit up. Okay, and everything else is still here. Okay, we got some we got some rare things on the item shop today. I've been noticing that Epic Games for like the past week or two has been adding like at least one rare thing every item shop. So little by little, a lot of rare stuff is coming back. So if you're picking up anything on the Fortnite item shop, be sure to use code ASMR Gaming. Let's check out Crystal over here. Fantastic skin. Clarity, Wits, and Vision. Now she has a summer style now, like a new skin. But honestly, the original is just as good. Like, I like all the Crystal skins so far that they've added in Fortnite. I like this, like, Crystal necklace that she has. I think the glasses are nice. Hair. I even like how, like, her shirt here starts kind of purple at the bottom and then turns more blue near the top. I don't know, like, it's the small things that make the skins really cool, especially the uncommon ones like this. Uh, this is a tryhard skin, so just be aware of that. And we have a Bronto. Uh, kind of looks like Barney the Dinosaur a little bit, because he's purple. Eating plants and taking names. So if you like dinosaurs, Bronto's a good one to pick up. And he comes with a Bronto bag, which has a little bit of an animated tail. It moves back and forth when you jump and run. One for the ages, Bronto bag. I have to say, though, I don't really see people using Bronto in games. Uh, I guess he's not that popular, but I really I really like how like the whole skin is almost completely purple. It, it's a very unique Fortnite skin. We don't have a lot of purple Fortnite skins. Here is the pterodactyl glider soar in the battle. Now, if you love dinosaurs, this also is a pretty nice one. I have this one. Uh, yeah, it's like a mechanical uh, pterodactyl glider. Fun fact, uh, in the original Jurassic Park movie, a lot of the dinosaurs and stuff were not CG. Uh, they were like actual like mechanical moving dinosaurs. So this is kind of almost like a reference to that. Kind of awesome. Bite mark. Take a bite out of the competition. Uh, this one has a nice sound. If I remember correctly, in-game, the mouth does open wider the more you hit stuff with it. But uh, it doesn't show that here. Nice sound. Cool design. Sadly, no special like striking animation. No, no explosion of color. Anything like that. It did come out in Season 3, though. And here we have Bright Bomber. The future looks bright. 1,200 V-Bucks. Not much to say about Bright Bomber, except that probably one of the most popular Fortnite skins and most recognizable Fortnite skins. I, I honestly believe that a lot, like, a lot of people own this skin in their locker. Uh, I would like to see the numbers from Epic Games, like what the most bought skins are, stuff like that, because I, I think Bright Bomber's definitely like the top 5, top 10 for sure. Uh, good skin. Been in the game since Season 1, and been popular since Season 1, so uh, people still use the skin, and for good reason. It's pretty cool. Here we have Bright Gunner. I like this skin a lot. Look, look on the bright side. Comes with a bright bag, back bling, super colorful. I like it. Don't forget to pack a smile. And I also like the clothes for this. Uh, I like this teddy bear with the explosion and the guns, and I think his hair is awesome. I, I like the skin. I think Bright Bomber 
is maybe like the more popular one and bright gunner is kind of underrated i think more people should use this skin here is the rainbow smash harvesting tool it's reactive has a nice striking sound and super colorful looks awesome definitely more on the expensive side though beat the stuffing out of them here we have the bright bimp blimp glider i was gonna say bimp <laughs> bright blimp Rainbow powered, 1,200 V bucks. Not a huge fan of this glider, which is why I never got it. But it does look nice. It does match, you know, the bright bomber, bright gunner skins. And then down here we got a rare one. Wow. Uh, I'm pretty sure Cloudbreaker is very rare. I have to go check, but I'm pretty sure it's been like 700 or 800 days or something since this has been back. Someone let me know in the comments. Call me crazy if it's crazy, but I, I'm pretty sure this is a rare one. Terrapulent by Nature. 1,200 V-Bucks. And chances are you've never seen anyone use this. So uh, hopefully more people pick this up now that it's back. Over here we have a wingtip. Uh, she used to be rare as well. But I think we actually got her back on the item shop a couple seasons ago or something. So... Uh, hopefully I'm right flying on the edge Here we got the dirigible glider Pretty cool looks looks nice actually. This is rare. I know this is rare Lighter than air. I have no idea when was the last time this came out like there's a few things which are like like if, if you saw this in game yesterday, you would be like what in the world is that? Because chances are, you've probably never seen anyone use this one. Like, even this skin, there's there's skins, there's gliders that you just never see. So when you see them on the item shop, you're like, okay, that's got to be rare. Because you haven't seen that in forever. Here we have the Dominion skin. Set the world on fire. Great skin. I like this one. It reminds me of, like, Devil Jin from the Tekken games. Comes with a flame sigil back bling. The underworld beckons. Here's the burning beast glider soaring from the underworld, completely on fire. The burning blades harvesting tool. It's got a nice sound, very sharp sounding. Feel the sear of hot metal. Here we have Malice. Misery is her playground. She comes with the Malice wings back bling, simply malicious. And the Burning Axe Harvesting Tool, which is popular among tryhard players in Fortnite. Immortal Instrument of Fire. Ooh. Here's the Burning Glyph Wrap. Show your style. Animated. Pretty cool. Reminds me of like Doctor Strange or something with all the runes. Nice. And then down here we have the Master Minotaur skin, who has a pretty cool back bling I'll show you soon. Unleash your manimal instincts. His back bling is the bull shield. Has like glowing blue eyes on it. And the shield actually looks kind of nice. Bullish and battle tested. Here's the dynamic shuffle. I really like the music in this one. And the emote's pretty good too. But the music is super like chill. I like it. I know the moves. Oh, Swamp Stalker is back. Pretty popular skin for some weird reason. I, I, I have no idea why it like started growing in popularity, but uh, you actually do see a bunch of people using this in games now. Master of the Mire. Here's a Shaolin sit up, mind over body. Good one. I like using it, like spinning in a circle in game. Dance therapy, classic almost at this point. It's season five. Let it all out. And the sack and emo, not a huge fan of this one, but it's back. Can you hack it? And then we got the AO and tail locker still here with Wake Up and My World. Great emotes, good skin, and harvesting tool. LeBron James, all this stuff is still here. Definitely recommend. And then we have these bundle packs, and that is everything on the Fortnite item shop. So thank you all for listening, for watching, and I will see you all next time.